everyone and welcome back to my channel if you are new here then i welcome you if you love watching handbag videos and a little bit of this and that then certainly hit the subscribe button but let's go ahead and jump into this video so y'all today i am coming to you all with a super duper duper super over over <laughs> okay that was probably a bit too much I am coming back to you all with a really exciting video, y'all. I am so happy. Let me tell y'all, 2023 has been amazing to me. I have been able to get so many awesome bags into my collection, bags back into my collection, bags that I have always wanted into my collection, long wish list items that I didn't think were possible to even obtain into my collection. And today, y'all, Today, I am coming to you all with a bag reveal. This bag here, y'all, I did not think I was ever, ever, ever going to get because it has been like four years now, y'all, since I have wanted this bag. And it has not resurfaced. Um, I could never find it on the resale market. I swear, nobody has been trying to let go of this bag. <laughs> But I want to give a shout out to whomever decided that they no longer wanted this bag in their collection because you have made me one happy handbag lover for real. So with that being said, y'all, the item that I'm going to be revealing to y'all, I did get from The Real Real. I do have to give a shout out to my sister, DJ King, because she, y'all, is the handbag whisperer for real. Like she really is the handbag whisperer. She has this particular bag, and I remember, y'all, I remember when I first got on YouTube and was, you know, watching the YouTubers, I came across the tribe. I did actually talk about them in my Dooney and Burt um, collections video, but those ladies are so amazing, y'all. So at the time, the tribe, um, I know Dooney at 615, Mrs. Q, DJ King, uh, Carmen Hawkins, they all had got this bag, right? And at the time... That is when I first found out that MCM actually had an outlet. So I did reach out to the outlet, y'all, but I was a tad bit late to the game and they sold out of this bag. So over the years, y'all, my love for this bag just grew stronger and stronger. Like, I still really wanted it. Like, I had no doubts in my mind that I wanted this bag in my collection. So the handbag whisperer, y'all, reached out to me and told me that this bag was on the real real. Y'all, I could not get there fast enough. I went on that website so, so fast and I ordered the bag, y'all. I ordered the bag, the bag came and I love it. So I am going to stop talking and reveal this bag to y'all. And also side note, I do want to um, apologize in advance, y'all. I did have like some dental stuff done. So I have a little bit of a lisp until I get used to all of this, <laughs> but um. Here is the bag and this dust bag. The dust bag does say the real real. And the bag, y'all, the bag that I finally got in my collection. <laughs> oh my gosh, y'all, this bag is so gorgeous. So this is the bag, y'all, that I have been lusting over. I have been wanting this bag. This is the large MCM Claire Hobo in the color Coco. And I am just in love with it, y'all. It is actually showing up true to color. So it is showing up true to color, y'all. And hopefully y'all can see the MCM print on this bag. If not, I'll insert a photo of it, y'all. But um, let me grab it here. So I do still have the tag attached to the bag, y'all. But I am well past the return date on this bag. Um, I just haven't taken the tag off because I wanted to reveal the bag to y'all first. But I love it, y'all. So let me tell y'all. When I first got this bag right, I did have to um, do a little cleaning to it. So it was clean, but it did have a smell. So I did actually first take my um, leather condition leather cleaner. I cleaned the bag really good, and then I went back over and conditioned it really good. And then the smell, y'all, it wasn't horrible, but it was like a faint smell that I wasn't really keen to. I didn't really care for. So I did actually have to do like the baking soda trick where you put your ba put baking soda in the bag. I let that sit over night i did actually um let the bag air out outside i did actually use some dryer sheets too just to try to 
give it a nice clean smell so now now it smells really good i really like the smell of this bag y'all the interior and everything was really um great still so this bag let me show you first it does come with this shoulder strap and this bag is a big bag y'all so i don't plan on using this shoulder strap with the bag but i think that's awesome that it does come with it and then let me take all of the silicone packets out i did stuff it with silicone packets too <laughs> just um yeah try to help things along so here is the inside really nice and spacious y'all so it does come with a zip pocket oh, i'm so happy i can't believe i have this bag <laughs> And then it does come with two slip pockets on the other side. And let's see. So as y'all can see, like the inside of this bag is so nice and clean. It is so clean. Um, it does also come with this nice shoulder strap, which I really love. So it has the cocoa color on that side. And then on the other side, it's kind of like a cognac color. Okay, and then you do get this really nice long zipper pull as well. Yeah, so I really love this bag, y'all. I really, really love it. Um, the one, oh, forgot about the back pocket. This bag does come with the back pocket, too. <laughs> so you do get a back pocket there. There was some corner wear, y'all, on this bag, but I'm okay with that because it was this closed before I purchased it. I'm known for, like, corner wear on my bag. So it was going to happen anyway. Um, but they did disclose it, so I'm happy about that, and it wasn't a shock when I got the bag. Now, I will say, y'all, that this size is, is quite amazing. Like, I love it because when you put your items in it, it, it has a nice slouch. And I love a nice hobo, y'all, with a good slouch. And the slouch on this bag is super duper good. It's just amazing. Like, I'm just still so shocked, y'all about me having this bag like i finally have this bag in my collection now i did pull out my medium claire hobo too because i wanted to do a size comparison for y'all the medium size is actually the perfect size for me i'm able to put all of my everyday items in it and carry it as an everyday bag but with that being said it doesn't have a slouch to it because it is a smaller bag and i do actually fill the bag up all the way so it doesn't it doesn't slouch but here we go let me it's hard to actually hold this because i have the strap off of it too <laughs> let's see let's turn it this way okay so as y'all can see it is a huge difference a really huge difference like this bag looks so tiny compared to this bag so see like so crazy right and here is the bottoms oh now y'all i am going to go ahead and insert me packing this bag up because i am going to go ahead and move on into my baby now and carry her i am just so happy <laughs> i am just so happy y'all about this so again thank you handbag whisperer shout out to you and again shout out to the person who Sold their bag to the real world because now I have it and I promise I'll take really, really good care of it. So before I stuff this bag, I want to go ahead and make it official, y'all, and go ahead and remove the tag from this bag because it is now officially mine. So we're going to cut it on off. Cut it on off. Okay. <laughs> So this bag is officially mine, y'all. I am now the proud owner of a MCM Lars Clara Hobo in the color Coco. I can, I still can't believe it, y'all. I still can't believe it. So now I am going to go ahead and pack this bag here, y'all. Um, so yeah, let's get on in it. So the first thing that I'm going to throw in the bag, y'all, is this pouch here. It says, happiness looks good on you. And I got this pouch, y'all, a few years ago from TJ Maxx. It actually came in a set. But I'm going to be using this little pouch, y'all, to hold my um, first day items. So I have all the little items here. I'm just going to put it all in the pouch. Antiseptic wipes lens wipes and bandages I have a goodie powder eye drops Tylenol 
In this little pill bottle, I have my allergy pills, a mask, and I'm dropping stuff, y'all. I'm dropping stuff. <laughs> More wipes and a contact lens. So that's everything that I'm gonna put in this little pouch here. Oh, well y'all, I guess it'll be helpful if I take this stuff out of the bag. I still have the strap in there and all of the silicone packets I threw back in the bag. So now we can throw the pouch in there. Okay, for my wallet, I'm going to be using this wallet right here, y'all. It is a coach wallet. And um, I I really love this color, y'all. I have been finding that I've been able to use this with a lot of my bags. So this one is like a little chameleon. I think it goes really nice against the cocoa color. And then I'm using the matching skinny mini, y'all. It is actually gonna hold my keys, and then I'm gonna actually put my um, most used cards on here as well, just for quick access. And I have my sunglass case. my uh, little coach coach pouch and this is holding my clinic i think i'm gonna actually slide this in the zip pocket in the back and while i'm at it let me go ahead and put this in the zip pocket as well so this is actually a little toilet seat cover um what else is going to go back there i'll put this back there too my chanel mirror I'll put this little notepad back in there as well. And last thing that I'll put back there is this right here. These are soap sheets. And I could put more in this pocket, y'all, but I'm not gonna stuff it too much. So yeah, that's everything that I'll put in the back pocket. So I'm gonna use this little pouch here, y'all. So this is actually acting as my cosmetic pouch and my little catch-all pouch. So in the back zip, y'all, I actually went ahead and packed it up with cosmetics. And let me show y'all just how much can fit in this little back pocket. And it's still slim, which I really, really love. Like, it's not bulging or anything like that. So yeah, I had all of this, y'all in this little back pocket. All of this, it all fit in there nicely. And like I said, it did not bulge the pocket at all. Doesn't wanna stay in there. See, so nice, I love it. And then in the front pocket, I have Lysol, Poopery, Ink Pen, tie to go pin and a little hair tie so that's everything that I had in this pocket here let's put it back in like this and this thing is so cool y'all like you this is actually supposed to be I think like a little bag because it actually has hooks on either side so you can actually hook like a um a strap to it and carry this as a little crossbody and it works y'all because it has already built in uh pockets in it for your cards it has two of them there's also a slip right here in the front as well but i'm not utilizing that slip and it did actually come with this little wristlet too so i did keep the wristlet on there so i'll just go ahead and throw this in the bag and i have so much space y'all like i'm telling y'all this bag is just so huge I am not going to be able to fill it up and I am completely okay with that. Let me, I guess, show y'all how everything is looking in there. Like, look at all of this room that I have in this bag, y'all. <laughs> so much room. So I guess I'm going to fill the pockets in the front next. 
So I'm gonna place my Trident gum in one of the pockets. Uh, I have my iWalk phone charger. I'm just gonna plop it down in the bag. Along with my fan and flashlight, I'm gonna throw that in the bag. I have my Touchland sanitizer that I'm gonna place in the other pocket. I have some hand cream that I'll place in one of the pockets. I have toilet tissue. I'll just throw that in the bag. And then I have my manicure set. This I am going to put in the pocket with the gum. So now, still plenty of space y'all, but that is all that I'm gonna put in this bag. Oh, I just love this bag so much. So zip it on up and as y'all can see, look at that. Oh, I have this little nice slouch in this bag. It's just so gorgeous, I love it. I'll go ahead and insert a photo too so that you all can see my accessories together with this bag. And yeah y'all, that is what I'm gonna be carrying in her. So that is that that completes this video i do hope that you enjoyed it if you did then certainly give it a thumbs up and i will see you in the next one bye